Hey everyone. So it's been a few weeks since I've actually been able to make my blogs. Been really, really busy lately. I know it only takes like two seconds to make a blog, but yeah, still been busy. <laughs> um, so for the past three weeks, I've been in nail class, trying and I still like you know learn everything day by day, trying my best not to rush through and learn the whole process like. So I can actually grasp everything that they're actually teaching. So when I actually get my clients, I'll be right on point. Like when I notice something within the nails, then I can always say like, you know, maybe you need to go check this out. Yada, yada, yada. You know, just knowing the do's and don'ts of nails. Because, you know, when we try to do nails from home setting and we're doing it on freestyle because, oh, we just learn how to do it on our own self-taught. We kind of don't know when to say no, like to certain things that we may see in the nails. We look past it, so that's another reason why I went to nail uh, tech uh, school, basically just to find like the do's and don'ts. To, I mean, you can Google it, but at the end of the day, like you know, like for the teacher to teach you certain things that other people may not know, or shall I say, the basics. It, I think school is actually crucial. So on Mondays and Tuesdays, I go to school. Monday is a straight hands-on. Tuesdays is the book work. And then the uh, second half of the class is hands-on. Although I said I'm trying to take my time or whatever, I'm still kind of, I don't know how, but I'm still ahead of the class. I think it's because I'm, like, really excited about learning certain things. And the professor is like, you know, listen, you got this. <laughs> on to the next, on to the next. So, so far I've been uh, doing really well. So she's, she's taught us how to file, to prep to um do the different shapes so far and how to blend a nail if you get an extensions how to blend it and so on last class um i did i learned how to do silk nails <laughs> never really understood the part of her silk nails i think she said something about it makes it the nail the natural nail harder or it's, it makes it much sturdier mm. silk nails i don't know um but I've come to realize that I think I want to start selling press-ons. Like, I do nails. I can do nails whether or not they're, like, designed with acrylic, so on and so forth. But press-ons are much faster. And it's just as, almost as sturdy as the actual acrylic. And it lasts just as long. Plus, you can act, you don't have to have a client in your face the whole time. Love my clients. But at the end of the day, like, you can collaborate with someone and then sell them basically with you collaborate and you could actually work on it by yourself take your time and know your designs do your designs as the best of your ability whatever instead of worry about because i'm that type of person like i'm like oh my god am i taking too much time for this pay, this client or whatever like so let me just hurry up and i you also ha don't have shit and rush i mean you know your stuff but at the end of the day you don't want to also rush and then you, you know um you're not as focused as you could be. So I'm going to start selling nails, press-ons. You can check out my videos on Glory, G-L-O-R-I, underscore nails, at Instagram. I don't know how this Instagram thing works. But on Instagram, you can follow me at Glory, underscore nails. Or on TikTok, same exact thing, Glory, underscore nails. And I show videos on basically like how I do my characters and how I paint but I'm about to start doing a press on journey. Like, I think it's very interesting, and I think it's the same, basically the same thing. Yet, I can still work in make beautiful nails and do it from the comfort of my home without worrying about time and making sure I can sell to people who like my art and like my style. So here we go. <laughs> I'm gonna start doing the press ons. Um, I'm trying to figure out how to do the video for it, but other than that, press on is about to be my thing. I mean, I'm still going to do regular nails or whatever, but on the side, as a side hustle, besides the nails, I think I'm going to try this out. Hopefully, I succeed. I know I will. Um, that's it <laughs> for vlog number four. <laughs> All right. Have a good day, y'all. Yeah. <laughs>